Want to know if you need your appendix removed? Well, I'm in that situation right now. So we're going to go over a couple things to kind of let you guys know uh, what to look for. Um, I've had a fever for the last couple days. Uh, I still do right now. Every night I go to bed, um, I have the sweats and the chills. Um, I've had diarrhea for the last couple of days and man, it hasn't been pretty. Um, but the biggest thing to look for, and I'm, I'm not any expert, but I will be at the end of this video, um, is to check which side. So this is my left hand, okay? And if there's no pain on this side, or if there's pain on this side, you're still okay, because your appendix is on your right side of your body. So um, I'm going to just swing the camera around. I'm not, not going to get naked or anything like that. But I'm just going to show you guys. So this is the, um, the right side of my body. I'm just going to pull down just a little bit. But they say if you start with your hip bone and kind of cross over to your belly button, it should be like right around here, which is where my pain is. And they say if you push in, it probably won't hurt. But if you let go, that, that just hurt. So if you let go real quick, it hurts. And, and like with me, it, it did hurt. So we're going to go to Kaiser now and get that checked out. And, uh, and one more thing too, just so you guys know I'm not faking. Um, there is no scar anywhere here. No scar at all. So after this, if I have a scar, you'll know I had my appendix removed. So we'll go from there. Thanks, guys. Okay, I'm here at Kaiser. I'm going to get checked in now. Okay, so we're at the Kaiser now, and as you can see, I'm obviously in a doctor's office, and uh, I'm going to get my tetanus shot, because I haven't had my tetanus shot in a while. I don't know what that has to do with anything, but I'm sure they know better than I. I'll follow up with you soon. Okay, so um, I've given them a urine sample, and they've taken blood from me so far. So, uh, still waiting to see the doctor. Follow me soon. Okay, so I just came back from the doctors, and uh, my doctor said that I have a lot of white blood cells, so that's a good sign. And that um, show, we took some x rays and stuff like that. They did find that um, in my urine sample, I had some blood in there, which to them says that this may not be an appendix thing, uh, it may be more of a, a kidney stone. And I'm like, wow. So, uh, I'm gonna go get a CAT scan done here shortly, but in the meantime, got some cranberry juice, so if it is a stone that I need to pass, um, that'll help. So, follow up with me shortly. So apparently, <laughs> it was not a kidney stone, and uh, I do need to get my appendix removed. Uh, I ended up getting a CAT scan, and they put it, some ink in my body, um, and they didn't find any kidney stones. So the doctor came up to me and said, you're getting your appendix removed. So I'm hooked up, and I'm just waiting for the doctor to call me for surgery. So. Hey guys, it's out, and I'm all drugged up, yeah. Okay baby, so you're out of surgery, you're back up in your room. Do you remember where you were in the video? <laughs> yeah. I said, yeah, I was sitting over there, mm -hmm. and I was letting everybody know that I was about to go in, and I had hook up to that thing with the IVs. Yes. Yeah. So how are you feeling now? Uh, worse than before I left. Okay. Mean. <laughs> now I'm going to go over to the morphine. Make sure you're happy, but right here. It says morphine right there. 
And there's the button. That trigger happy. Which he can do every 10 minutes. <laughs> and it's only been two minutes since he last did it. If it hasn't kicked in, it's a problem. Well, we'll come back to another video <laughs> when it does kick in. Okay, so I literally just got out of the hospital like an hour ago. I just came out of the shower and uh, obviously I'm sure you want to know what happened. My appendix got removed and um, I'm going to turn the camera on real quick so you guys can see. But uh, it's about a little over, an, about an inch. I just stapled it all up. But yeah, I uh, spent the last three days at the hospital and uh, you know, it varies. Different people have different amount of days, but she's out.